Mr. Morgan, you seem chipper. Well, where there's life, there's hope, my friend. And? We've been thinking about our problem all wrong. All wrong, that's all. Meaning? All in good time, my friend. All in good time. <laughs> Always the show, ma'am. It's time to take your head out of that so, damn book. Mr. Morgan, whatever did happen with that Mary Gillis? Uh, it all came to nothing, Miss Grimshaw. Mm, that's for the best. Sure, of course. I never did like her very much. Good morning, Arthur. Gotta help me out here, mister. Can you? Please. I've been on the run for days now. Uh, if you could help me with these shackles, I, I just might have a chance. So how'd you end up like this? Just shoot the damn chains already. Come on. Just shoot the chains off, please. I'm done for otherwise. Come on, do this! Oh! Oh, oh, yes! Yes! Perfect! Ah, thank you. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. I... I got no money to give you, but... I think I might got something even better. Some of those fellows talked about this old crone up north of Strawberry. Got herself a tidy sum locked away. Maybe just stories, but... They were sure excited. Oh, yeah? Why'd I be interested in that, huh? Um, I don't just a hunt. It's up to you. I'd keep low, I was you. Yeah, you got that right. Do you smoke, sir? Sure. <laughs> Perhaps not as much as you. Oh, <laughs> no, no, don't worry about these. Actually, well, take some. Take a couple of packs. Take a few. Oh, thank you. What are all the cigarettes for? You had on a long journey or something? <laughs> no, nothing like that at all. I'm just interested in the cards. 
Okay. Cigarette carts. What you got? Yeah. Well, get them out. Let me take a look. Come on, come on. A picture card? Yeah, I'll pay you a good price. Okay. Here. Ah, nothing I haven't got. The value is in completing the set. Sometimes I'll smoke up to 200 cigarettes in one day, just so I can keep opening the packs. I wish I could explain to you the pleasure and the pain I get out of collecting these babies. Sure. Well, it sounds, uh... Thrilling? Yeah, it is. Not to mention the vast amounts of life-reaffirming cigarettes I get to smoke. Oh, and the amount of money. <laughs> A veritable fortune, sir. Fortune? Oh, sure, sure. A complete set of any series is worth a fortune. Yeah, look at this. Gunslingers. Over here, circus freaks. Yes, yes, yes. Meow meows of the desert. So rare. I never knew. Sure. How much? Well, it depends on the rarity, sir. Oh, of course. Yeah. But you know, if you ever get a complete set, I can uh, take it off your hands. You'd pay me. A fair price. Now you send them to me right here. Phineas T. Rand bottle. At your service. I gotta run. This is my train. Look me up, okay? Think about this deal. Only a complete set. That's where the value lies. There we go. don't understand this at all! Hey! Over here! What's the problem? Problem? No, there's no problem. Quite the contrary. Well, there is a problem. For me, but not for you. All right. 
I ain't got time for no, this. No, well, no, wait! Give me a minute of your life. I might just change it forever. I'm sure you will have heard of me. Maximo Cristobal Valdespino, the renowned explorer. Can't say I have. There has been much written about me. I once had high tea with the Viceroy of India. I helped liberate South America. I've climbed mountains and swum across seas. I have had many women. I've spent the last three months hunting treasure on the American frontier. Beautiful country. Reminds me a lot of Almeria. But tomorrow I set sail for the island of Shikoku in the Japanese archipelago in search of the legendary Tokushima Sapphire. Mm. Well, good for you. No, no, hold on. You see this map here? It was made by the Jack Hall gang. They robbed banks all the way from here to California. Yeah, I know who the Jack Hall gang are. Oh, them you have heard of, but me? Huh. Well, uh, rumor has it they buried gold somewhere in this area, but were killed before they could retrieve it. They created two maps when it was well hidden. This is the first and should lead you to the second. You just need to follow the landmarks drawn here. Me? Yes. Unfortunately, I am out of time now, but I am prepared to sell it to you for the low price of $10. A trifling investment for a man such as you, given the potential returns. Ah, uh, what the hell? Why not? A very wise investment. I wish you the best of luck. Easy. Long, girl. Yep. Easy. Whoa.
Easy, girl. Yeah. Whoa, now. You think you're so great. Hey, kid, why the moping? You're making the fish miserable. Hey, mister. I just want to be left alone, all right? A sentiment I'm familiar with. Fair enough, kid. Strutting around, nose in the air. Holding hands with that dump. Come on, kid. You care about this girl? Stand up for yourself. She'll come around. Yeah? I've been waiting. Trust me, kid. There ain't so many good men out there. Make yourself one of the good ones. Thanks, mister. I hope you're right. You wait, Lily Mae. Someday, I'll show you. Okay, there. Hey, partner. Oh. Hello. Why today, isn't it? Sure. What a country. I'm working on a project. Photography. Yeah, I guess that bit. <laughs> of course. Wildlife. That's my thing. Or that's what I want to be my thing. If I have to take another picture of a grumpy housefrau or pompous middle-class burger, I will feed myself to the lions. Stand here. Here? Just... 
There. Albert Mason. Arthur Morgan. Pleasure. I'm trying to find and capture images of our great predators before our greatest predators kill them all and stick them on some clubhouse wall. Good luck with that. Yes, not the easiest. But, well, I love a challenge. The trick is to leave a big load of meat and relax and pray they don't mistake me for lunch. Oh, good heavens. My bag, that thing is robbing me. Go, oh, good heavens. Don't worry. That thing is a coyote. Sneaky one, too. Easy now. And Kyle, don't think about coming back. A bag full of meat will tend to bring out the worst in the local population. You are a gentleman. The bag also had a lot of my supplies. You've saved me days. I can't thank you enough. I'm, I'm, thank you. Don't worry about it. I'm, uh, you take care, sir. I ain't the one trying to get myself eaten. I realize I am a fool. Forgive me. And thank you very much once again. Look, you think maybe you should leave the wildlife photography to the fellers who know a little something about wildlife? If every great man had thought like that, there wouldn't be any great men. A little ignorance can go a long way. At least, that's what I tell myself. Or it can get you killed. But hey, good luck. Please, if I'm to attract any wildlife, I'll need some privacy. There, girl. 